hello every hello everybody uh, in this video we are going to create imagine mq so it's a uh, very simple so i just try to search imagine mq go to imagine mq so here i created already having M M uh, active mq so let me create um, a broker you have to click on the create broker select Amazon, select Apache Active MQ. So the Amazon MQ supports two, one is the uh, Apache Active MQ and another Revit MQ. So select Apache Active MQ, click on the next button. So here uh, it selected active standby broker, you could see that. So this is used for the production purpose as you are doing in the development. So select single instance broker. So I'll, I'll, I'll uh, record a video for active standby click on the next button so here you have to select the instance type uh, m5 large is something used for the uh, you know more cpu more workloads uh, in the production purpose so you don't need that much that uh, you know that machine so we can looking for the some uh, free tier so let's look for that t3 dot micro this is the free tier one select this one so i'll uh, select um, my first active mq then you have to give the username password uh, username i'll give the test and uh, the minimum is 12 uh, password is minimum is 12 characters at least four unique characters let's me try my first active mq i'll put in this way my first active mq my first active mq at one two three okay so let me look at the additional settings this is the uh, indian version is used by the active mq so you don't need to select uh, much if you are going for the logs then you can select uh, general audit again i'm not going into the details so we are using the which subnets we are going to run that we could see but i'm using the default vpcn subnet but in general in production environment they used to have their uh, existing uh, they used to have their uh, vpc as well as subnets and um, public accessibility i'm putting as yes okay so uh, enable automatic minor version upgrade so that is the maintenance purpose uh, for this uh, of this active mq for the minor versions they you can uh, they can do it automatically but if he wants to for a, for the major versions you can select the maintenance window and you can select the time at what time so as for that uh, the aws will do the maintenance so I, at present i'm selecting no preferences you can put any tag as a as a name key any any key value pair again i'm making it blank so now i'm going to create the broker okay let me remove this create a broker so it could it could take at least uh, 15 to 20 minutes so in this time i'm uh, i'm i'm pause this uh, video so once uh, this active mq is created i'll again resume the uh, resume the recordings 